What's up everybody, Isaac here with Civil Engineering Academy coming at you. I am in lovely Washington. Check it out. Huh? Pretty nice. This is the Columbia. Huh? We're hanging out by Wallula. I'm gonna shut this because traffic, traffic is rather loud. Uh, lots of traffic here. Anyway, coming at you live from the car, I just wanted to come and give you another quick tip for Civil Engineering Academy. Uh, my quick, quick tip today is how to manage your time and specifically how to manage your time with kids. There's tons of people that take the PE exam that have a family and they kind of wonder how they're going to get it all together and manage their time with all this stuff. So um, how do you do this? How do you manage it? That's what we're going to ask and answer in today's quick tip. All right, so the question again is, how do I manage my time? How am I gonna prepare for the civil PE exam or the FE exam if I have children, if I have a family and lots of demands? So the first thing that you need to do is get your family on board and support with this major goal in your life. Um, obviously, this is gonna help your career in a lot of different ways, not only just with money. So make sure they understand how crucial this thing is to get it under your belt. And then you need to dedicate specific time in your day to study for this thing, whether that's at night or as I, I would recommend trying to do as much as you can at work if they let you. A lot of employers will allow you to study at work because the value of you getting your PE or FE under your belt is what puts them on the roadmap and looking like a better firm as well. So a lot of companies uh, will help you or allow you or give you time to do that while at work. So study as much as you can while at work if you have children. And then my other quick tip is if you have children, um, obviously you need to, if you're gonna get them to bed, your prime study time might be later at night. So maybe nine or 10, squeeze in a couple hours there as well. So um, really you gotta find uh, these little fringe or niche times throughout your day so that you can study for this exam especially when you have children because it does make it hard when you got to do family activities. So there are a couple tips for you. One, study as much as you can at work or go early or stay late. Uh, do as much as you can during office hours or before or after. And then the second tip is also make sure you've communicated with your spouse and your children how important this goal is to accomplish this in your life and that you need to dedicate some time to do it. So whether that's uh, carving out some time, they know it's a special time to study, or whether you do it after they go to sleep or both, um, that's a schedule that you need to set up uh, and communicate with each other on. So anyway, there's some tips for you to help to study when you have children in the home. Hopefully that helps you. I'm gonna step outside and you can check out this sweet, sweet view I got. Huh? Check it out. Start here. Look at that. 